What's good, YouTube? Nappy Boy 92 here, back again, once again. And today, people, today I have the next Let's Play on my channel, the next Pokemon Let's Play, or I should say, the third Pokemon Let's Play on my channel. This is Pokemon Soul Silver version, as you can see, motherfucking Logio on the screen right now, nigga. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I'm so fucking hyped to play this right now. Um, I haven't played second generation Pokemon in such a long, long time, so this is partially a blind playthrough uh, for myself, you know. Uh, I played a lot of Pokemon when I was younger, and then, you know, as you grow up, you kind of grow out of it. But, you know, I'm getting back into it now. Um, some of you might remember my Sapphire Let's Play, of course, the black and white I did with uh, Cuddle of Death, aka Kristen, or she said the other way around. <laughs> but, um... I'm happy, I'm excited to do this. I have not played the Soul Silver or Heart Gold versions of second gen. If I said that wrong, if Heart Gold and Soul Silver aren't considered second gen, you know what the fuck I'm talking about. Um, I haven't played them yet. I've only played the original uh, second generation, so this is going to be a, a new experience in and of itself, just seeing everything uh, all over again. So, oh, I'm excited. Um, first, I'll tell you, so, uh, the lower screen. I don't give a fuck, no info needed, let's go. Black people don't read instructions, <laughs> anyway. Anyways, let's see what we got here. Hmm, looks like the sun is descending in the sky. So this would be what is called twilight, wouldn't it? Oh, I just, I was guessing it was gonna be motherfucking oak, and look, here it is. Sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Professor Oak, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. Before we go any further, I'd like to tell you a few things you should know about this world. I gotta up the fucking, uh, the whatchamacallit rate, uh, the, the tech speed, whatever the fuck it's called. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. We humans live alongside Pokemon as friends. At times we play together, and at other times we work together. Some people use their Pokemon to battle and develop closer bonds with them. Whew. Now why don't you tell me a little bit about yourself? Are you a boy, or are you a girl? Won't you please tell me? I'm a motherfucking boy, nigga. What the fuck you think I look like? So you're a boy then? Yeah. Please tell me your name. Nigga. Don't ask me why, but I always uh, use caps for my name in Pokemon. I know that drives some people crazy, but I've always used caps for my name in Pokemon. I don't know why. So your name is Nappy. And I'm going to let you guys know right now, 90% of the voices are going to have some sort of British or Australian accent. Don't ask me why. That's just how I play the damn game. Don't ask me why. Most of them are probably going to sound like this. Nabry, are you ready? Your very old tale of grand adventure. You know, something like that, like an old man voice. So just get ready for it. Your very old tale of grand adventure is about to unfold. Fun experiences, difficult experiences, there's so much waiting for you. Dreams, adventure, let's go to the world of Pokemon. I'll see you later. Let's go. I'm excited. Alright, here we go. We are in the motherfucking game. Can I get a goddamn potion, please? Let me, oh, I don't want a fucking mailbox. Fuck you, Lyra, I don't know who the hell you are. But, first thing I want to do is, uh... Oh, well, damn, all my controls are all jiggity jacked up. I'm about to figure that shit out so I could do shit. Uh-oh. Hi, Nappy. You're finally awake. Your friend Lyra was just here. She was playing hide and seek with her Meryl. Oh, I almost forgot. Our acquaintance Professor Elm was looking for you. He said he had a favor to ask of you. You know where the lab is, right? It's right next door to us. By the way, do you have everything you need to go out? Here, use this bag to carry things. Oh, well, boom, there it is. This is your trainer card. Here you can save a record of your progress. These are also rather helpful. Just try touching the buttons and you'll know what to do in no time. Well, goddamn, I guess that's why I couldn't change shit, because I don't have fucking options. Ah! Uh. Nope, ah, yeah, yeah. Get me downstairs. Alright. Let's change the damn tech speed. Fast. Mm, ooh, I forgot about the different frame types. Can we get a, uh... I'm dressed in all black. I like that number 10. I think I might go back to number 10. Ooh, that's freaky. Yeah, let's just wrap number 10. Alright. <coughs> <coughs> Alright, let's go fucking find, uh, Lyra. Lyra assist! Oh! Oh, fuck. Here's the Meryl. I like the graphics on this. I really do. 
I really like the graphics. I think I like this better than um black and white, but that's just me. I don't know. Some of y'all might disagree with me on that, but we'll see. Lyra, who the fuck are you? Get your marrow out of my fucking face. Please and thank you. God. Alright, so let's see what the hell. I don't have my running shoes yet. Oh, it's like one of my biggest pet peeves. What if I talk about? I like to have my running shoes. <laughs> I'm not even doing voices for him. Alright, so is Lyra upstairs? Can I go talk to Lyra? Can I beat some fucking sense into her and tell her to fucking watch her Meryl? And I just skipped through all of that shit. Professor Elm, what's looking for you? Did you go to his lab? Alright. <coughs> the, uh, the female voices are going to uh, vary a lot. Um... I kind of just did voices just randomly um, off of, oh look at this bitch, that's my rival, I remember him, let's go talk to him, I think it's him, so this is the famous El Pokemon Lab, <gasps> what are you staring at, get out of here, god, uh, fuck you, uh, I'm gonna creep in the window, but yeah, I just kind of did voices on Sapphire and they kind of just stuck, everyone said they liked him, so, fuck it, let's go, oh Elm, he's like a younger version of Oak. Hi, Nappy! I've been waiting for you. Do you know anything about my research? As you know, Pokemon are carried in Pokeballs these days. But before the Pokeball was invented, people used to walk with Pokemon, just like your friend Lyra does. Lyra can't control her Meryl. Put the Meryl in a goddamn Pokeball. Pokeballs are great because you can carry Pokemon. But walking with Pokemon has some advantages. It could have done something to do it could have something to do with how Pokemon grow or evolve. So I'm gonna give you a Pokemon. Can you walk beside this Pokemon outside of its Pokeball to see if it brings any special feelings or bonds between Pokemon and people? The device over there has some Pokemon you can choose from. Whew, his voice is fucking intense. Oh, hey, I got an email! When did they get email in the world of Pokemon? The fuck? Uh <laughs> okay. Hey, listen! I have this acquaintance that people call Mr. Pokemon. He keeps finding weird things and raving about his discoveries. Anyways, I just got an email from him saying that this time it's real. It's probably another Pokemon egg, but we're so, so busy that our Pokemon research, and I didn't even read that right, but fuck it. Wait, I know. You can go in our place, right? Can we count on you? You can choose one of the Pokemon over there. Alright, so this is a really, really tough decision for me because out of all of the starting Pokemon from all the generations, Generation 2 has, in my opinion, the best starters, and it's the hardest to pick out of all of them. I'm not a huge fan of Chikorita, but Meganium is fucking amazing. <sighs> Typhlosion? I mean, his name is fucking Typhlosion. That's fucking awesome. But my heart is is with uh, this little nigga right here. Let's go ahead and just check out Syndicate real quick. Ooh, I gotta rock with Totodile. For Alligator, that's my dude. That's my dude at the end of the day. I know I just said it's hard to pick, but I mean, that's my dude. Do you want the Totodile, the water type Pokemon? Yeah, nigga, let's go. I received Totodile. And I'm going to do the one thing in this Let's Play that I never do in any Pokemon Let's Plays. I'm going to give a nickname to my Pokemon. And that's really, really hard for me because to me, it's like they already have a name. Why would you call them something different, you know? But, ah! I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna give my Totodile a nickname. <sighs> you see, here, here's the problem. Here's the problem. Here's the problem that I always have with it. I don't think it's so much about giving them a nickname. I think it's giving them a name that I'm comfortable with the entire time. You know what I mean? It's like it's like when you name when you have a kid, you don't name your baby like uh, Barbara. Barbara is an old person name. So it would be weird to have like a Totodile named Barbara. Does that make sense? I'm, I'm rambling right now. Like for example, Fred. Like let's say I named my Totodile Fred. Fred might fit for Alligator, but Fred doesn't fit Totodile. See what I'm saying? And it's the exact opposite way. Like if I name my Totodile Bobby, you know, a Tot I mean a for Alligator is not a good Bobby. Does that make sense? It's weird. I don't know. <sighs> so when am I gonna name my Totodile? Hmm. Hmm. Mm, I don't know what to name him. Oh, I don't know what to name him. What do I name my damn Totodile? Fuck! 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 
can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it. I don't know why this is so hard for me. I can't do it. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm sorry. I know the, that nicknames help make the Let's Play a little more personable because, A, you can call them whatever you want, but I can't do it. I just can't do it. <sighs> I'm sorry. <laughs> How do you like walking with your Pokemon? It's not bad, is it? You can take it all the way to Mr. Pokemon's house. If your Pokemon gets hurt, you should heal it with this machine. It's so easy to use, just check the PC on my desk. Mr. Pokemon goes everywhere and finds rarities. His house is past Cherry Grove City. Go north, a little past Cherry Grove. I'm counting on you, Nappy. Bitch, I got this shit. Oh, Lord. Oh, he's gonna give me a Pokeball, right? I want you to have these to help with your task. Oh, potions. I could swear someone gave me a Pokeball somewhere. Some generation. Pokemon are weak in beginning. Don't hesitate to use a potion if you think yours in danger. <clears throat> Someone left a comment on one of my Sapphire videos saying it's so annoying how he gets the different generations mixed up. I don't give a fuck, okay? It's a let's play. I'm just here to play the damn game. God. Nappy! Whoa. That's her voice. That's her voice right there. <laughs> ah, ha, ha, ha. All right. So you picked a Totodile. That's a cute Pokemon you have. When you walk with it, it'll become more friendly. You should turn around and talk to it sometimes too. Oh, that's right. Why don't you show it to your mom? What you say about my mama? See ya. All right. That's a really fucked up voice. I ain't even gonna lie, but fuck it. Let's go. That's homegirl's voice right there. Oh, God. I, I, I want to stick with that because I feel like I can remember that. It's easy to remember this. When sometimes, <laughs> nine times out of ten, I'll forget anything else, so. Oh, like her fucking voice. I forgot what it was already. Oh, Nappy. That's a cute Pokemon you have. Professor Elm must have given it to you. Oh, Professor Elm has a task for you, you say. What kind of task? I see. That sounds a little difficult. But when someone makes that kind of request of you, it must be important. Oh, that's right, I completely forgot. Your Poke Gear came back from the repair shop. Here you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Pokemon Gear, or Poke Gear as it's often called, is what every trader should have. Guess what? You could use the Poke Gear to make a phone call too. Do you remember how? No, I ain't calling nobody. Select the Poke Gear button on the touch screen, then select the telephone button. The names of the people you can call are automatically registered. Just select one to give him or her a call. Wow, I can't believe it's so easy to make a phone call. Alright, let's blow this joint. Shit. I'm gonna get the fuck up out of here. Now, do I get to battle, uh, home homeboy? Not yet? Oh, lord. Oh, uh, fuck, I forgot his voice. God damn it, I'm horrible short term man. Wait one second. I think that's it. Come on, Elm. Why you walk so slow, bro? I was completely forgot about this. Here, I'll give you my number. Oh, Lord. I ain't calling you, yo. I ain't calling nobody. I'll call you if anything comes up. I remember they like you to have like random trainers like call you be like, hey, you want to battle again? Yeah, I battled you like three hours ago. You have a level 12 with Hoodoo, and I got a fucking level 50 for alligator now. You want to battle? Let's go. You know, stupid shit like that. Alright, everyone. It's time for my first battle. Pidgey. Ooh, I might just catch me a Pidgey. Whenever I play, um, original, original, uh, fucking first gen, I always pick up a Pidgey as a flying type Pokemon. And uh, from the best of my knowledge, there's not a whole lot of, um, decent flying type Pokemon in second gen either. I might just catch a Pidgey. I don't have any Pokeballs right now, but Pidgey may just become part of my party. We'll see here. We shall see. We shall see. We shall see. I need to get the um <clears throat> the fast forward set up as well. Uh, I am playing this on computer. I know a million people are gonna ask me that. You know, how are you playing this on computer, Nappy? Coolroms.com. They should fucking sponsor me. C O O L R O M S dot com. That's that's how you do it. And if anyone can't figure it out, Google is your friend. That's all I can say. So uh. <laughs> Just go, go check them out, see see what you can do, and uh, I'm actually playing this with a Xbox controller, a USB, plug it into the computer, all that good shit. That's like the number one asked questions on all of my fucking Let's Plays is, how are you playing this, Nappy? How do you do this? How do I, can I, can I do this? I really don't want to use this potion, but at the same time, I don't want to walk through all this grass and not get the, the training in, you know? 
so I don't know. We'll roll with it. We'll roll with it. But yeah, that's that's how I'm doing it. I'm saying this in episode one, so that if anybody watches this, you don't ask me later on down the road when you watch it and then decide, hey, I want to do that too. You know? So. But we'll see. I already know someone's going to leave a comment that says, how are you playing this? Level two, Pidgey? Like, for real? For real? Like, is this is this serious right now? Is this for real? Is this for real, yo? <laughs> is this for real? Cause I'ma just uh shit all over this nigga right her. Shit all over this nigga right her. Shit all over this nigga right her. Just like that. <laughs> I'll take it! Level six! Yeah yeah. I wanna get my uh Oh we learned water gun, that's good. That's really good. The one uh trouble that I had with Sapphire was uh this is the bottom of that mountain pass, I remember that. The one trouble that I had with uh Sapphire was um uh whatchamacallit? Whatchamacallit, whatchamacallit, whatchamacallit? Um, my Torchic, I chose Torchic and Sapphire, and it doesn't learn any fucking fire moves at all. And I was like so pissed because the entire time I had this fucking fire Pokemon, or what I thought was a fire Pokemon, and it didn't know any fire move. So I'm happy that Totodile is learning some water moves right off the bat. And I'm happy as well because um, the only HM that I will teach to, well there's two HMs actually, Surf and Fly are the only two HMs that I will teach to a main member of my party. That's not like an HM slave, you know? So I'm happy because I'll end up teaching Surf to Totodile. So we're all good in that sense, so I'm happy. Yeah, I'm happy nigga. I'll take it. I'll take it. And I'm gonna scratch this nigga real quick. <clears throat> so Surf and Fly, if I can catch a, a Pidgey, a decent leveled Pidgey. And I ain't catching no level 2 Pidgey, fuck that shit. But uh, if I can catch a decent level Pidgey, I will uh, teach it fly and we'll be good to go. What you want, what you want, nigga, what you want? Pokemon that only appear at night? Ooh, fancy. You're a fancy Pokemon trainer. Ooh, oh fuck! I wanted to get back out of that patch of grass. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. Dun, 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 dun. Another goddamn Pidgey. Shit! Well, I'm gonna use water gun on that pigeon. Um, I don't do this very often, but um, I wanted to go ahead and, and uh, see if you guys are interested in watching these. Um, what, what, what um, time length for a video? I, I'm making this question very, very awkward. More awkward than it needs to be. But uh, how long, how long of a video is good in your opinion? You know, uh, I normally try and keep anywhere between 20 and 30 minutes. But which one would you rather watch? 20 minutes or 30 minutes? Like, I never asked that in any of my Let's Plays, so it's really, it feels really weird for me to do that now. But, let me know what you guys think. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you like, I can teach you a few things. Okay, then, follow me. I didn't even get a chance to answer, bro. And you walk really fucking fast for an old man. Am I supposed to follow you? Oh, huh. I'm sorry. I forgot that you aren't wearing the running shoes. Oh, you my new best friend, nigga. I'll try to go as slow as possible, so try to keep it- Oh, I thought he was gonna give me the running shoes. Fuck this dude, he ain't my friend. <laughs> this is a Pokemon Center. They heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you'll better learn about them. Man, you don't know me. This is a Pokemon Mart. They sell Pokeballs for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. God, he walks so fast. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling their Pokemon there. If you go a little farther, you'll see Mr. Pokemon's house. Oh, hey. It just happens to be where I'm going. You're in the water, bro. Getting your shoes wet. Oh, look, there's a trainer. This is the sea, as you can see. Well, no shit. Some Pokemon are found only in water. My Totodile ain't gotta be in only in water, because he's a motherfucking beast. He's an alligator. Here is my house. For your effort keeping up with me, I'll give you my running shoe. Fuck yes! I take everything I said back about you. You are my new best friend. Gave me the goddamn running shoes. They're still warm. Yeah, that's nasty. Got you, didn't I? Don't worry, there's a brand new. Uh, let's see. Guide. Is it Gent or Gent? Guide Gent. The instructions read. Oh, that's not his voice. <laughs> also, hold the B button down to sprint. Well, since I'm not using motherfucking. Um, Oh, ho, 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 I got the runny shoes again. Runny shoes. I love it. All right, I'm gonna go heal Totodile just cause. 
just because I got the option to. And I can run indoors? Oh. Ooh, I love it. Oh, turn it on. How's that one counter? Go ahead, follow it. Woo. Go ahead. I love it. All right. Look at Nurse Joy, or the other Nurse Joy guarding the, the stairs. Like, I give a fuck about what's down there. <laughs> All right, let me go see. Can I get a damn Pokeball? Because I will catch me a motherfucking Pidgey. Right now. You don't have any Pokeballs. All right, you are worthless. Get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> Tell me Pokemon ain't got no damn Pokeballs. Nigga, please. Oh, fuck. I made it! I forgot one... I forgot about one thing. This is another token from me. Take it. The guy gent loaded the map card on Nappy's Poke Gear. I can now show the town map. Where did it go? Oh, it's not an option to pop up. Select the Poke Gear on the touch screen and then select the town map icon. You'll see the map of the region you're currently in. Aha! It's a hint that they're gonna go to another region! As if everybody doesn't already know. <laughs> the Poke Gear becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Nigga, you done? Can I go? Can I go now? Can I go? Can I go? Can I go? Go, 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 go. Weedle. Man. I'd be dead before I call me a Weedle. I had that nigga to my party. A lot of people, um... They're either, they either kind of agree with me or they're, they're kind of upset that I tend to plan out my party. Some people kind of just go along catching Pokemon, and they're just like, oh, whoever's in the party, living in the party. Like, I kind of have a rough idea of who I want in my party already. Normally, that's what I do. Like, when I did black, I had an idea, uh, or when I did black. When I did black and white with Kristen, that's, that's, I kind of had an idea where I wanted to go. When I did Sapphire, I kind of had an idea where I wanted to go. On here, not so much. You know, like I said, it's been a while since I played second generation, so I don't remember the Pokedex, you know, to key so I just I just knew I wanted to start with Totodile um, I might pick up the Pidgey I probably pick up a Pidgey now that I'm thinking about it because like I said I don't remember very many other uh, flying types in the game but we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see we'll see and one of these days I'll do a goddamn let's play where I nickname my fucking Pokemon <laughs> I just I can't I can't bring myself to do it I don't know we'll see it'll happen one of these days it'll happen I promise but I do want to get rid of this goddamn Weedle. I need to get the fast forward button set up if I can. Um, I don't want to sit there and say that I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, just to find out this this uh, ROM or this version of the ROM doesn't have it. But I mean, it's, it's Desmond May, so I should be able to uh, fast forward. I just need to get my controller configuration right. Get, uh, if you're not a trainer, I don't give a fuck about what you got to say. Apricorn tree. Oh, I don't have the little, the, the, the nut bag. <laughs> People usually come to my house looking for Mr. Pokemon's house. You did mean to visit my house, right? How good are you? Do you have any apricorns? Apricorn trees made for once a day. I have one of these trees too. Apricorns are really something. You can make Pokeballs and other things. They're quite useful. I have a feeling this is meant to be so I'm having this. I just gave him that retarded ass voice just now because I have a feeling I'm never going to talk to this guy again. So I didn't want to give him a voice that I'd have to remember, you know? But uh, since Homeboy Game and Apricon Box, or as I call it, a nut bag, <laughs> I will go ahead and, uh, green apricorn, green, green apricorn, I will go ahead and, uh, pull that apricorn off there. I just ran through that whole field and didn't fight a single Pokemon. I ain't mad. <laughs> I ain't mad. Why are you not a trainer? God, I want to fucking battle somebody. I want to poop on some foreheads. You all are battling. Pidgey Rattata, come on. I'm gonna fuck you up one of these days. Oh, god damn it. I accidentally hit left on the pad. I didn't mean to go left. <laughs> oh, a Kakuna. Oh. Mm. Again, another Pokemon that I wouldn't be caught dead with in my goddamn party. <laughs> Kakuna. He was hardened. Yeah, I would use the uh, the fast forward button for scenes like this, you know, unimportant battles. Like I wouldn't use the fast forward button on like uh, rival battles or um, uh, gym trainer battles, and of course, eventually the Elite Four I would never use that on there. Water gun, nigga. Water gun. Wow, wow, wow. Water gun, nigga. Water gun. Wow, wow, wow. Water gun. But I do want to 
hurry up and get to Mr. Pokemon's house. And if I do recall, Mr. Pokemon's a nice old man, so I'll have to bring out the old man voice again. <laughs> but anyways, let's go ahead and poop on this Kakuna's forehead real quick, like. Real quick, like. Get that XP. Level up. Oh, I didn't level up. Give me, give me, give me to the grass. Oh, damn it. Look at this grass. Fuck. Oh, fuck. On the last bush, really? God damn you. I would catch you, Pidgey. Well, I mean, I've seen level four. But I mean, level three is not that far from level four. But I don't get you to know. Uh, I would. I, I don't know. I might catch that Pidgey. Well, I wouldn't catch that Pidgey because my attacks would kill him. But hey, told her I was level eight. I'll take it. I'll take it, nigga. Told her I learned rage. He is just the buddy little youngster, isn't he? Just learning all types of shit. All right, is we at Mr. Pokemon's house. Hey, look, I see a pink nut. <laughs> We'll go to hell for stupid shit like that. Pink apricorn. I'll take it. In the apricorn box. Apricorn box! Oh shit, there's oak. Two old men. <coughs> Alright, old man boys. You must be Nappy! I. Oh, well, there we go, there we go. It was I who sent an email to Professor Elm earlier. I might be a little over the top, but nah. We only talked to him in the beginning of the game. This is what I want, Professor Elm, to examine. Mystery egg. Isn't that a Togepi? I think it's a Togepi. I'm pretty sure it's a Togepi. A friend of mine from Ecritique. I probably butchered that name. Ecritique gave it to me. I bet you can't find this kind of egg in Johto. I thought Professor Elm might be able to tell what it is. He's the best when it comes to the research of Pokemon evolution. That's quite, that's a, that's a quote from the famous Professor Oak. You are returning to Professor Elm. Here, the Pokemon should have some West. Yeah, here my niggas. Oh my nigga, I should say. Oh Lord, here comes old man Oak. And with that, I'm Professor Oak, a Pokemon researcher. So you're nappy. Yeah, I was just visiting my friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Who told you? Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon! I see! You must be helping Professor Elm's research. I think I understand why Professor Elm gave you that Pokemon. You will treat your Pokemon with love and care, it seems. Ah! You seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia! I like, I'd like you to have it. Whew, there's the Pokedex. Alright, we're just missing one. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I've stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Nappy, I have a feeling that this is not the last time we'll meet. Let's exchange numbers, just to be on the safe side. Oh, God damn. All these people want to give me their goddamn number. I'm never going to fucking call you, dude. Never, ever, 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 ever. Ever. In a million years, I'm never going to call you. I want you to know that. Are we done here? Alright. Let's get the fuck out this. See, like I told you, I'm never gonna call nobody. Everybody gonna call me. <laughs> Hello, Nappy. It's a disaster. Uh, uh, it's just terrible. What should I do? Uh, oh, oh no. Please get back here now. Damn. I didn't get to. I didn't fucking talk to you. All right then. Let's go back to fucking original city town. <laughs>